We begin tonight with that controversial photo. Good evening, I'm Dominique Soxa. I'm Bill Maessa, thank you for joining us. The photograph shows a white Prairie View A&M student with black tape on her face. It's gone viral and it has upset an awful lot of people. Brandon Walker is joining us live now with reaction, including the university's response tonight. Brandon? Yeah, Dominique, many students here saying the picture is disturbing, but there are a lot of questions here on campus tonight about how the campus community should move forward in all of this. As a matter of fact, tonight, right now, students are gathering to begin that conversation, and we are told it will begin as a learning process for all students here on campus to come together. So why would you do something that you know people are automatically going to feel a certain type of way? She was wrong for doing that. It's a picture and a caption that has students at Prairie View A&M talking. In it, a Prairie View student who's white with her face wrapped in black tape. It's caption when you're just trying to fit in at your HBCU. HBCU is an acronym for historically black college and university. The picture, which the student posted to social media, quickly went viral. All over social media and a lot of group chats. Upset a lot of people, too. Prairie View junior Christopher Light says the tongue lashing the student has received on social media, though, is not the answer. The slander and stuff like that is just not how you respond to things, and it's just, you know, it's, it's just bad. You don't do people like that. And Prairie View A&M President George C. Wright posted an extensive response to all of this on the school's uh, Facebook page. Here's an excerpt reading in part, quote, We have a duty to educate our community to always try to act in a responsible manner and recognize that speech does have consequences. The president and the school going on to say that President Wright will have much more to say on this next week. Other students saying that there will be more about this conversation, how to move forward next week as well. We'll keep you posted on this story as it continues to develop. We're live tonight in Prairie View. I'm Brandon Walker, KPRC, Channel 2 News.